the Mysterons, sworn enemies of Earth. Possessing the ability to recreate an exact likeness of an object or person. But first, they must destroy. Leading the fight, one man fate has made indestructible. His name, Captain Scarlet. Well, it was very nice seeing you again, Major. Well, I appreciate the opportunity of looking over Cloud Base. And I've been most impressed. I'm glad to hear it. A lot of time and money was spent making it the most efficient base ever built by man. The Major's plane is ready to leave, Colonel. Thank you, Lieutenant. Duty calls. I'll say goodbye. I'm sorry I was late meeting the Spectrum jet. How soon do we arrive at Base Concord? Well, in a matter of minutes, Major Reeves. Good. I have a great deal to do. Will you be there long, Major? Major? Strange. Something wrong, sir? Need some air. I'm going out on deck. Better, sir? Better? Uh, oh, yes, I uh, feel a new man. Can I help you, sir? I'm Major Reeves. Oh, yes. They told us you were arriving, Major. You're alone? Yes, sir. But I can call the rest of the crew. No. Secure the doors. Sir? I'm telling you to secure the doors. Yes, sir. I want you to put this program into operation at once. Excuse me, sir, but this is impossible. The VGR is top security. Do it. But this isn't even an official order. You need five-star authorization. This makes it official.
and you will have no way of knowing its target. We have not forgotten. We will continue our war of nerves. Seven two zero. Code word Z E R O zero. Open up in there. What in places goes on here? Whoever's in there won't open the doors. Well, use the emergency detonator. Blow it in. did this had to be one of our own people. No one else could have gotten past security. The only person that entered the control room was the new rocket expert, Major Reeves. Impossible. He was assigned to us directly from cloud base, and they can confirm it. Call up Colonel White, Spectrum. <laughs> I've been trying to contact you, Commander. Our tracking monitors picked up a rocket which appears to come from your base. Something's very wrong. Our rocket controller has been shot and a VGR launched. A variable geometry rocket. Who do you think is responsible? It looks like Major Reeves is the only possible suspect. Major Reeves, the man we just sent you? Right. He was the only person to enter the control room. Could the controller have launched the VGR and then shot himself? It's possible. But uh, that doesn't account for the fact that Major Reeves has disappeared and the flight program unit is missing. Airstrip to control. Go ahead, Airstrip. There's been an unauthorized takeoff by an interceptor jet. Who's the pilot? Space Major Reeves. Well, that clinches it. Did you hear that, Colonel? I heard. I think you've proved your point, Commander. It looks bad. My guess is that Major Reeves has been taken over by the Mistrons. Is the rocket armed? I'm afraid so. It has an incendiary warhead. What's the target? Well, that's just it. We can't tell. What? Reeves took the flight program unit. Without that, we've no way of knowing the target. You telling me it could strike anywhere? Right. Could be London, Washington, Moscow, just about any place. Lieutenant Green, order an immediate search for Major Reeves. Launch all angels. Yes, sir. Angels one, two, and three, immediate launch. SRG. You will proceed as directed in search plan red to find Major Reeves. He's flying an intercepted jet, type J-17. He left base Concord at 1800 hours and is believed to be carrying a stolen unit. It is imperative that this is retrieved and returned to base Concord as fast as possible. Repeat, we must locate Reeves and that flight program unit. Was Major Reeves a close friend, Colonel? He was a friend, but we must face facts. He is almost certainly now a Mr. On. Lieutenant, get Captain Scarlet and Captain Blue up here. Yes, sir. We're in a tight spot. We know the situation, sir. Good. The tracking stations around the world should find the rocket. Will Base Concord be able to destroy it by remote control? Yes, when they've wired in the new units and if they can find the program code word, and only Reeves knows that. Right. 
We've got to locate him, and fast. Negative so far. Continuing search. Right, Melody Angel. He should be somewhere in this area. Since we know how fast he can travel, he can't have got more than 100 miles from the rocket base. Every three minutes, we're projecting the new radius. Each angel is scanning an area with high-powered radar. One of them is certain to pick up Reeves. I'm starting a new sweep. So far, no sign of Major Reeves. SIG, Rhapsody. Negative. He is not in this area. Right, Harmony Angel. We have negative reports from other angels. He must be in your region, Melody. Yes, Colonel. I've just picked up something on my radar. It could be Reeves. International Fix System 2826, heading 048 Magnetic. <laughs> should have visual contact any second now. Yes, yes, confirm, have located interceptor jet type J17. Don't lose him, just track him. We need that unit. Captain Scarlet? Yes, sir. I want you and Captain Blue to go to base Concord. We leave immediately, Colonel. Remember, time is against us. Every second takes that rocket nearer its target. Glad to have you with us. What's the news? We've located Reeves, sir. Great. We needed a break. Have you sighted the rocket yet? No, sir. But I've extended the range as far as possible. Well, someone must pick it up soon. Sir? What is it? The report's on the VGR, sir. Well, what do they say? All negative, sir. Not one tracking station has located it. Well, that's impossible. It can't have disappeared. I can't understand it. I just can't understand it. I thought the VGR was designed to fly under the radar screen. Only in the final stages of an attack. It comes down about 50 miles from its target. Wings swing into position, and then it flies like a conventional plane. So it's still flying as a rocket now? Yes, Captain. Well, could it still be too high? Wait a minute. If it's traveling on an absolutely vertical flight path, the radar would lose it. Yes, it's just possible. A vertical flight path? Do you realize what you're saying? Yes, sir. If it's going straight up, it must be programmed to come down in this area. And the only target within 300 miles Space Concord. Well, I hate to say this, Sergeant, but I think it's the only explanation. This base is under attack from one of its own rockets. A rocket specifically designed to overcome any form of defense and reach its target. Sir, the replacement unit's been fitted. Emergency procedures are nearly complete. Well, that's something. I want all non-essential personnel evacuated immediately. If the rocket hits, it could start a chain reaction. 
I hope Spectrum realized the urgency of the situation. Yes, Commander, we certainly do. Still have visual contact with Reeves. Damn it. Angels 2 and 3 are on their way. What is your position? IFS 2467, heading 124 magnetic. I am closing in. We are right behind you, Melody. Been hit. I'm going to eject. We're going after Reeves. Send rescue unit to pick up Melody Angel. Right, but stay out of rocket range. SIG. Sir, what is it? The rocket, sir. It's just come on the screen. Ah, at last, it's within range. Right. Try for the air destruct. We need the code word, sir. Well, start at Able and work on through the list. A, B, L, E. Able. Negative. A, B, L, Y. Ably. What are the chances of finding the right code word, Commander? Well, there are 10,000 listed in our manual, so I guess it's 10,000 to one. A real long shot. Yes, Captain. Too long. Negative. A, B, U, T. A butt. Negative. We're stumbling around like blind men. Unless we get Reeves and that code word, we really haven't a chance. A C H E, ache. We'll come up one on each side of Reeves. Right, Rhapsody. I'm going to try to reason with him on the radio. S I G. And stay behind him. Remember, he's already shot down, Melody. Don't worry. I'll be careful. Major Reeves, we are going to escort you back to Base Concord. You have no choice but to come with us. Unless you return to Base Concord, we will shoot you down. You'll not do that. I have something you need. Time is running out, Major. If you do not alter course, we have nothing to lose. We will shoot you down. In that case, I have nothing to lose.
Major Reeves has deliberately crashed. There is no chance of recovering the flight program unit. A-L-L-Y, Ally. Negative. What's the position, Captain Scarlet? The whole base is evacuated. And the commander? He was the last to leave. Right. We've done all we can. Leave immediately. The rocket will strike in approximately three minutes. <laughs> Captain Scarlet? I'm giving you an order. Leave at once. Well, I never could resist a long shot. Captain Scarlet! I'm sorry, Colonel. Radio SIR. A-L-M-S, arms. Negative. A-L-P-S, Alps. You will both face a court-martial for this. Come in, Captain Scarlet. Impact, minus 38 seconds. Negative. A-L-S-O, also. Negative. Impact, minus 20 seconds. A-L-T-O, alto. Negative. Fifteen. Just time for one more try. A M E N. Amen. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Negative. One. Zero. We did it, Adam. We did it. Well, you must be feeling very pleased with yourselves. Well, yes, sir, we did save the base. You did not save the base. Naval frogmen found the flight program unit near the wreckage of Reeves's jet at the bottom of the sea. The code word was zero. Where were you up to? Uh... Amen, sir. Very appropriate, but a long way from zero. The rocket was destroyed by a stroke of fate. Our whole organization is built on discipline, and you willfully disobeyed a direct order. This cannot and will not be tolerated. I'm considering further action. Dismiss. Will there be court martial, Colonel? No, but one more question like that, Lieutenant, and you will be. They are brave men, and Spectrum needs brave men in our continuing fight against the Mysterons. Captain Scarlet! Captain Scarlet. Captain Scarlet. 
scarlet. You're indestructible, Captain Scarlet.